I think it's time we blow this scene. Get everybody in the stuff together. Okay, three, two, one, let's jam. On today's episode of Women in Action Director Mob Psycho 100 Season 2 Episode 10, Guidance, Psychic Sensor. Holy shit, what the fuck did we just watch? That was ridiculous. As of right now, that's the best episode so far. So many fucking awesome things happened. We see the return of Matsuo, and he, of course, is carrying Mogami, and after Mob runs into the fucking plant dude, he gets unleashed. Like, I love that they're bringing back these characters. It's very good continuity. It does bring up the question, though, whether or not not Mogami is truly dead or whether he just vanished I have no fucking clue but I love to see that there was some kind of respect or a little admiration between him and Mob allowing the espers to live because in all honesty if it was up to him he'd probably just fucking crush him in his giant tree hand but I gotta say the highlight of this episode is definitely Shimazaki versus Retsu and the Hanazawa half of the anti-claw movement I'm so glad they're not using any kind of power scaling there it's it's, it's just very good at showing Showing how OP a person is and then comparing them to mob. It's fucking ridiculous. So you have all these people fighting Shimazaki. Shimazaki's fucking gets like what? Two scrapes and a bruise. And it was only when he was distracted that they actually got a couple of good hits on him, which forced him to open up his mind's eye. It takes everyone down in a single fucking punch. But unfortunately for him, this is actually his downfall. Yes, getting rid of all distractions and only focusing on espers. He instantly senses mob's energy and now he seems to be distracted by that, allowing Reagan to come in and do a barrage of punches that knocks his ass down. Yes, that was fucking hilarious. Anytime Reagan's in a scene, it's usually gonna be fucking funny. And basically the battle ends with Mob getting serious and Shimazaki shitting his pants and running away. Like that whole entire sequence of battles, it was just fucking amazing. This whole episode was amazing. And I gotta say, I am super, super excited for the next episode. See, I never knew why Sho took this chance to take on his father and Claw. Was it the fact that Claw was finally making its move? I don't know, but it was interesting that show brought up the fact that he's been channeling his energy storing it up for the last three months whether I missed it or not I was truly curious as to understand why he thought he was ready to take on his dad at this point but then the dad comes around and says hey I have the same fucking ability I've been doing it for 20 fucking years so now here's an interesting interesting dilemma we have mob who has this unbelievably deep wellspring of fucking energy the biggest we've seen in the series so far versus a guy who's been storing up his psychic energy for 20 fucking years I I think this battle is gonna be fucking ridiculous and honestly I am looking forward to this so fucking much and with that being said I cannot wait for future episodes <笑>面白い。果たしてどちらの能力が上か勝負です。正面から迎え撃ってあげましょう。<笑> 